Okay, so I'm my movie collection. Let's see now. End of the month. It's gonna be like a planning video. End of the month. And see if my trips and snacks held up. Um, chocolates are already gone, so I do need to get at least one more pack of chocolates to last out the rest of the month. The last few days, okay, but. A lot of my money is now going back into my snacks and into my lunch. So when I go thrifting next month, it'll be a very selective uh, process. So I'll, if I see something I really need for DVD, I'll get it. I'm not going to be buying TV shows from them unless it's something I need to complete. See if they are still marking up their prices. They've been marking them up all summer, so. Might as well just buy it off eBay and pay the $10, $15 on eBay instead of paying the $10 at the donation store and paying $5 on the bus. Sometimes I could get back, sometimes I have to pay another $5 to get back. So, But I will try to go thrifting on Christmas, so we'll see how things go. Sometimes I could get some Christmas CDs then, and I will get better games next year. Still a couple more middle price games I want and one or two high price games I want. So for Atari and the USB controller for Atari. So there's still a couple things I could do for Atari. A couple things I could do for NES and trying to start up my Super Nintendo as well. But it's a little bit more pricey. So I have to wait on that a little bit till I get some of the better TV shows. So. It's going to be like that for spring and summer. Make sure my I get a good spot on my snacks, a good spot on my lunch, and then anything a little bit extra after that will be for the TV shows. TV shows probably be once a year or every so often I can pick up a TV show. So some of these four or five big TV shows I want. Some of them can cost between 200 to 300 if you're getting the deluxe. So I'm not going to bother with the deluxe all the time, so I'll try to get the cheapest one I can. I don't collect Region 2, although Region 2 is the cheaper format, but it's not a format Blockbuster ever had. Not a format I grew up watching, it's like a Chinese foreign movie. You never grew up watching it, then you don't know. But I will try to get a little bit into a uh, Blu-ray, but we'll see how things go. Don't know if I'll start up records or not, but I'm still trying to get Olympic cassettes coming in. But other than that, I think uh, this is the room. Disney, been, I'll try to pick out one or two things that Disney comes spring, summer when I go thrifting. Try to get caught up on the TV shows is the first thing I need. If I weren't doing TV shows, I would probably do more uh, toys and Transformers and stuff like that, but. For now, I get all the vintage dolls on display, and this is the newest one I bought. So, unless if one falls down and breaks. So I was doing these uh, haunted dolls off eBay a few years back, and then I decided I don't, I'm not going to do haunted items anymore. I want to do more uh, TV shows, because these dolls uh, can get pretty expensive on eBay. So I never really got to do a haunted box unboxing. I know. They're pretty fun to watch sometimes, but I never got to do that, so. Uh, other than that, I will try to get a little something with any extra I get. But most part, I need my snacks at this spot. So I still have got end of the month. A uh, couple bags of chips, a couple cookies left, but the chocolates are gone. These are my everyday snacks, so. Looking alright. I could try to pick up a little rare movie every now and then. Or a game and then I'll come back into my music try to get some country maybe a little bit more on a rap some stuff I could not get before as well and pick and choose some of the movies I need to like I still need one or two for Halloween they can cost anywhere between 40 and 50 dollars for some of them lucky I already have all the Friday 13th on DVD so um, we'll see how things go in the spring thanks for watching